can this route be blocked? It's, it's all different from my plan. Let's just take another route. But I've only ever taken this one route. If we don't go this way, then we might not have enough food to make it there in the end. Huh? Muni, you should cheer up. Look into the distance. Huh? <laughs> Do you see that cloud over there? That type of cloud is called a lenticular cloud. Lenticular cloud? Clouds have all kinds of different shapes. There are three main factors that create different types of cloud, like how much moisture is in the air, changes in the air temperature, and the speed of air movement. When a fast-moving airstream meets a landform and moves upward, it creates a wave within the airstream. And as the air moves upwards, the temperature gets lower, and the moisture in the air condenses into a cloud. When the air streams move downward, the temperature rises, and the water droplets that form the cloud evaporate, causing the cloud to then eventually disappear. This creates an unmoving lenticular cloud, and within the continually moving airstream, moisture is not distributed evenly. Some air layers are saturated with water droplets, and some are not, and this results in multiple layers creating a thick layer of lenticular clouds. So that's how it works? There's another situation that can cause lenticular clouds. When air from the ground moves upward and creates a cloud, if the air above it is moving downward, then it will put pressure on the airstream so the cloud can grow upward. The edges of the cloud will evaporate and become thinner because of rising temperatures below. This creates a cloud shape like a pea pod. The same shape of cloud you see can be formed by many different circumstances. There are also different ways of traveling to the exact same place. And not just one right path. Yeah! Muni, huh? we'll find a way together. As long as we stick together, we'll find our way to the village safely. 